you guys for this for our senior project. We're going to be telling you a little bit about it. So we just hope you give us your attention and just sit there and learn some stuff. So for those of you that don't know me, my name is Brian Pagan. My name is John Paro. I'm Ramona. Hey, I'm Terry. And I'm Sincere. So what is college unpreparedness? We surveyed around 55,000 students, and we found out that at least one out of two students would say that they feel academically prepared for college. As you can see in ninth grade, the percentage is 52, 49, 50, then 50. As you can see, as you go on in high school, um, as you go on and you learn more knowledge about the college application process, you your decision starts to change on whether or not you feel academic, academically prepared. So now, I'm pretty sure you guys are familiar with the term college of preparedness. So how can we prevent college of preparedness? So like what steps can we take to combat that? Yeah. Pay attention to CCR. <laughs> you can have an early start to like the whole the whole um I I don't see idea behind the concept like start freshman year. Yeah. So like have an end goal in mind. Yeah. Start eighth grade. Start eighth grade. Yeah. Right. Start Where'd you go? Huh? Where'd you go? Where do you go? <laughs> Would you go? Would you be prepared if you were in a game? Would you like oh, you're asking, was I prepared for this thing? Oh, oh hell. Just like. <laughs> I was having a problem with my life. Alright, so some tips we have are to ask a lot of questions, whether it be about the college application <coughs> process or just in your classroom. You want to get into that mindset of asking questions and wanting to learn more. Because that, that way you set yourself up to succeed. Because you're always looking for knowledge, you're always looking to learn more and understand it. Attend college tours, get a feeling of whether you want to go away for college or not. Is it a, a private college, a public college, one in state, out of state, or one that has dorms? Get a feel of what you like and what you don't like, which colleges speak to you and what don't, what the feel of the campus is, and just see what college is like because I promise you it's so much different than high school. Sign up for AP classes. Next year, this year there's five, next year there's going to be six, they're adding AP computer science. So just try to sign up for as many as you can, because that's the closest thing you'll get to a college class here at AMS besides taking an actual college course. And the last thing is to remain persistent, because senioritis is real. They don't kick your ass, so. <laughs> yeah, just keep persistent, stay on top of your game, and finish your last year strong. Because colleges do look at your senior year. All right, so one of our proposed methods for combating college of preparedness is through Voila, AMS Alumni Network. So basically our idea for the AMS Alumni Network is that we take people who graduate from AMS, right? So us and seniors before us who go to college, right? And the idea is to be able to contact them and ask them questions about how the college experience is, what you should know about, how it is academically. It's mainly just as like a support frame to help you get a feel for um, how college is and how college life is. So, and it also will help you determine on which college is great for you. Like for example, if I'm like for example, I'm going to York, right? Anybody else going to York? Anyone? York? Yeah. So like for example, you can ask me how how life is at York, and I could give you um, I could tell you how it is to see if you really like it, and tell you what they do there. Thanks. Okay. So why do you guys appreciate the Alumni Network? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. So project, project. Okay. Why are you guys looking to be alumni of the board? Yeah. To get first hand experience about how college life is. I mean, to be honest. I feel like it would have a greater impact than hearing it from like Mr. Murphy. Because <laughs> <laughs> no one's because they you're like closer in age, so I'm more you're more likely to tell me like, oh, yeah, you're gonna party a lot. Or something. He's not gonna tell me that. <laughs> We're not old. <laughs> We're not old. I'll change it to you. Uh -huh. uh -huh. <laughs> so pretty much, to the alumni work that you can to like ask a question about the application process. So like, what do you need to do? What do you, what's the deadline? How you guys, how we did it? Ask about life in college. So like, if, you're, if you want to go away, like you could ask like, um, alumni, the alumni people like, oh, how life in college? Did you get to do this? Get to like experience like the campus or whatever. 
and like just to get some general tips for like making it through senior year, try to like be on top of your stuff and like just. Alright, so on, with the laptop for your dev, you are just going to take a few minutes to fill out the survey that is on the board. As you fill out the survey, I want you to take this very seriously as we're using the data for our project, in addition to just being as kind of honest as we can. Alright guys, so we'll take like another like five minutes. How did you guys get 55,000 people to take this survey? Oh, that was youth truth, yeah.